Wales champions from the AFL. Been just a shock tonight to learn that Hawthorne is actually training at Waverley in preparation for Saturday's crucial game against Collingwood. Well, let's cross live to Stephen Quartermain. Steve, uh, Hawthorne's common sense become a little bit waterlogged as well down there? Not quite, Ed, but I think it's no secret the Hawks would rather be training at Glen Ferry Oval tonight. But uh, tonight after training, they have a corporate function here talking about jobs, believe it or not. So Waverley it is tonight. In fact, the ground's not too bad. From the, the centre to the outer wing, it's quite firm. But here in front of the members, it's still very boggy and soggy. Pretty ordinary to say the least. So I think you'll find a lot of the football on Saturday will be played uh, across that outer wing. Huge game for both clubs. Hawthorne must keep on winning if they're going to get into the top six. Collingwood now uh, in danger of losing that double chance. So they too uh, must keep on winning. A big game for them. Early Earlier tonight I spoke with Tony Hall who returned to his best last week with 34 possessions and three goals and he says he's looking forward to the challenge. Yeah, the MCG was, it was fantastic just to play on a, a, a nice firm ground, hard, hard ground. But um, looks looks all right tonight actually, it looks better than what it has been. So um, let's just hope it you know, dries out a little bit more by the, by the weekend. But it is a little bit hard, but I guess it's the same for both sides and, and uh, we've just got to adapt to it and, 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 and work hard. Well, Stephen Lawrence very doubtful on Saturday for the Hawks.